Hey guys, oh, it looks like it's a little bit foggy. Okay, hey guys. Um, I am having dinner by myself tonight because Joseph was super, Joseph was super sweet and I am gonna wait for some of you guys to hop on here. I'm gonna wait for some of you guys to hop on. I'm gonna make a really, really simple dinner for myself tonight because Joseph, oh my goodness. So um, Joseph was super sweet and took one of my siblings to a doctor's appointment. And so um, they went for Chinese. I don't eat Chinese anymore. Um, that's just a personal choice, but um, they went for Chinese Joseph loves Chinese, so I'm eating by myself. And so I thought I would just keep it simple. Honestly, guys, I'm gonna have a peanut butter and jelly and I'm gonna make Joseph one for work tomorrow so that he's already got his like lunch for work. Um, so I'm just keeping it super simple. And I thought that if I made a peanut butter and jelly with that new cinnamon raisin bread that I got all of her. Hi, buddy. Oh, goodness. Right after I pet the cat, I'm going to make my dinner. Hi, Oliver. Good evening. Here's my boy. There's my boy. Hi, sweetie. Look at him. Look at my boy. Can I have a kiss? Hi, Bubba. Hi, sweetie. Hi, sweetie. Hi, cutie. I love you. Oliver. Oliver, I love you. Oh, he's the sweetest. Isn't he cute? I can only do I don't like the Quest flavors of protein shakes. So I will not do Quest. Premier is the only one that I've had that doesn't hurt my stomach. I can't, I've tried the Equate brand and things like that. Um, and I just can't have it. Not right now. Not right now. Mom's gonna make her, her, her dinner, okay? Gotta wash my hands because I just pet the cat. Um, normally I would never Oliver get down. Get down. I've got to cook. Oliver, get down, child. Get down. Cats cats don't eat peanut butter and jelly. Oh my goodness. Okay. I Honestly, Oliver, you need to get down. Get down. Get down. Child. Hey, I just washed my hands so that I can make a peanut butter and jelly. Aw. I'm so He loves it. Hey, Oliver, get off the counter, son. Okay. I'm using this. He's a big boy. I have no clue how much he weighs. By the way, y'all, I have a cat. Sometimes I just, yeah. Oliver? Okay, y'all. Honestly, I don't care. He's my cat. So if anybody wants to come on here and be mad at me, he's my cat. <laughs> so I got this carb, not a gluten-free cinnamon raisin. I've never tried it. I'm going to toast it. It is a point per slice, which these are actually pretty big slices. So I'm going to toast it just because I do prefer like my bread when I'm having sandwiches to be toasted. I'm not going to toast Joe's because I'm making it for lunch tomorrow. I'm going to make his as a PB and J for lunch. By the way, y'all, I know I pet my cat. He doesn't care either. It's his cat too. Um, 
since we're in our own house. I'm pretty sure some of Oliver's fur is a secret ingredient in our own meals, um, if I'm being really honest. So, pretty sure every, not that I make it for other people, just so y'all know, just so y'all know, I'm pretty sure everybody's cats, just their fur is everywhere, right? Okay, so this carbonata gluten-free bread is a point per slice. My dinner tonight is honestly gonna be some bread, PB&J, and some grapes. That's what I'm having. It's carbonata or carbonat. I don't know how to pronounce it. And then I'm I'm gonna just make some peanut butter from the peanut butter powder. Guys, I got a little bit lazy, okay? I got, hang on. You guys asked for a photo of this again. I posted it on my page. It's carbonat, gluten-free, cinnamon raisin. Honestly, no. I don't really have three meals a day. I usually have two meals a day and a small snack. Today I had a protein bar and fruit for my snack. So, I normally don't have three full meals a day. That's just me though. Um, I'll probably have a snack after my dinner in about an hour or so. Probably have some popcorn, things like that. That is kind of what I do. I leave enough room in my evening. My goal is to leave enough points left in my evening that I can have a snack after dinner, okay? That's usually my goal so that I'm not eating, I'm not overeating whenever I have a snack after dinner and normally I either do a protein snack or what do you mean what will Joe eat tonight then? Joseph went to a Chinese buffet. I don't eat like that. He still eats like that on occasion. My husband went to a Chinese buffet. I'm having something simple because he went to a Chinese buffet and I won't eat that way. in the dishwasher right now so no paper plate tonight no um he is coming back from um taking one of my siblings to a doctor's appointment which was not planned, it was last minute. We didn't know that they needed help getting to the doctor and I was out of town. So if anybody wants to wonder why, um, wonder why I, I didn't take them, I was out of town and I didn't know that they needed help getting to the doctor. Otherwise I would have been in town. So, um, Oh, okay. I found a tablespoon. That'll be good. So, the thing is, Joe and I eat the same a lot, but if there's a meal he wants to have that I don't want to eat, he can have it, you know? Like, he can literally, well, I know, but somebody asked why, what Joe's going to eat if I eat something simple. I'm having two tablespoons of this. It is a serving yeah, my sibling needed help getting to the doctor and we were able to do that. So, um, 
and they like Chinese and I was like, hey, if you guys want to, you guys can have um, Chinese tonight. And so, because I know my siblings like Chinese and so I was like, if you want to go have Chinese with them, like I'd be more than happy um, for you to, guys to do that. And so this is the sugar-free peanut butter. This is the PB Fit powder. And so, yeah, he, he honestly, Joe's more than happy. This is a little bit runny because like I added a little bit too much water. So it's a little tiny bit runny. Oops. Normally it's not that runny. I usually make it a little bit thicker. But, and sometimes what I'll do is like, okay, so that's the, I'll make it a little bit thicker for Joe's probably. So that's the peanut butter. Yeah, Joseph supports me and I support him. Honestly, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the rest of my, because the thing is I need these calories and I need these points, okay? So I am putting this to the side and I'll just put a, probably put a um, banana on the side of my plate or something to dip that in. So yes, this has a peanut butter taste to me. So I'm going to also um, make Joe's a little bit thicker. So that's a little bit of a heaping of a spoonful, but um, let's see. I'm using less water on his and sometimes that I'll do that. Like I'll add a little bit of, I don't measure the water because I try to make it a little bit thicker. And so I'll stir this. Joe's and then I'm gonna add I'm gonna add a little bit more water here I add a little bit of water at a time because a little bit goes a long ways with this but since his is going into like a sandwich bag I want it to be like a thicker peanut butter so that it's not like runny and like like I said okay see that's chunky I'm not putting any kind of skinny, if you're talking about skinny syrup, no, I haven't put it in the peanut butter because I just haven't, this, honestly, this really does taste like peanut butter. The sugar-free one, I actually personally think the sugar-free PB2 powder tastes more like peanut butter than the regular one. The sugar-free one, personally, in my opinion, tastes more like peanut butter than the regular one does. That's my personal opinion. Um, so I'm gonna add, take this, I think this is gonna be a good sandwich for Joe tomorrow. I'm taking this sugar, the cinnamon raisin bread and making like a peanut butter and jelly out of it, which, I think it's gonna be good. Peanut butter is so good. Mm. Peanut butter is so good. Okay. I haven't tried the bread yet. I haven't tried it yet. Got some peanut butter on my hands for sure. Oh, by the way, for any of y'all that think that I only have stuff for me in this house, I have this tea towel that says, I love you to the Death Star and back. It's Star Wars. I don't watch Star Wars. I have no interest in Star Wars at all. I just have this for Joe because y'all, I don't watch Star Wars. Don't know anything about it, but I have this tea towel for Joe. Um, y'all, I'm being serious. I don't know. 
I don't like cream cheese. I personally don't like cream cheese, but that's just me. I'm weird about cheese and dairy and things like that. So I don't have any more, I don't have any more um, tablespoons. This is one tablespoon serving for zero points. So we'll just do that. This is the grape. I believe the grape is zero points for one tablespoon. So we'll see if, um, I honestly don't eat Chinese um, unless I make it myself these days or if it's like, if I go to somewhere like, um, let's say like a Japanese steakhouse where they make um, like the grilled chicken and veggies option mainly because and it's not because I've given it up I don't like sodium I do not handle sodium well at my weight because it's it all goes to my feet and it swells up and it's just not fun like eating Chinese like P.F. Chang's yes I will go and do a kid's grilled chicken and vegetables because like without the sauce because yeah hibachi um without the sauce and i don't do rice anymore that's just a personal choice though guys because rice just doesn't fill me up like i just don't ever feel full so i don't like i don't like eating foods that don't make me feel full and that's just it um that is just it so this is how I made Joe a little PB&J. That's what I'm having for my dinner with um, some grapes. I toasted my bread because I like my bread to be crunchy, but it wouldn't make any sense for me to toast Joe's bread for work tomorrow because he's not home yet. Oh, thank you. Thank you. That's very sweet. Um, yeah, I actually, um, safety wise for myself, I don't tell anybody except for my mom and Joe where I am these days. Um, or my, like, I don't even, I don't tell anybody where I'm at anymore. Um, honestly, no. Even when I was in my weight loss journey, I wasn't doing three meals a day, what I was doing. Um, what I was doing for the very beginning of my journey was I was not doing meals per se. At the beginning, what I was doing is small snacks every hour to two hours, like very small snacks all day until dinner time. Like from breakfast to lunch, I was doing like a five or one bar and then an apple and then a banana and then a pack of like pop chips and then like maybe a yogurt. I was doing something small every couple hours because they actually say that um, that is good, like small snacks throughout the whole day. That's what I did for a while. My I've changed things up. I mean, as my journey has changed, like my eating habits have changed throughout the whole journey, you know, it's not been the same the entire time because we evolve and things like the way that I eat has changed throughout. And so it's just, I've just not stayed the same. And honestly, um, there's a lot of times that people are like, Kylie, you don't eat the same anymore. And the thing is, is that like, we're not meant, we're not meant to stay the same. We're meant to change, you know? The only thing that stays the same in life is that we have to pay, we all have to pay taxes and we're all going to meet Jesus someday, you know? That's the only thing that ever stays the same. So, I'm sending Joe a banana. Hopefully these are good. Um, people have gotten upset in the sense that, like, throughout, it is the polliner jelly. Throughout my journey, like, I've become, started eating healthier and healthier and healthier. Like, 
and I have. And I think that like there are people that message and say, hey, I noticed like you cut this out and this out and all that. And it's just because like through my journey, like there were just foods that I realized didn't fuel my body. So like, for example, not very often do you see me eat rice. That's not that I never, ever, ever eat it. It's just that I'm in recovery for binge eating and I have found the foods that fuel my body in a way that I'm not hungry. Like chicken, for example. I eat a lot of chicken because whenever I eat beef, my body just doesn't handle it well. I don't feel full on beef. Also, guys, three tablespoons of this peanut butter can be zero. There is still some left in this bowl. So I'm just gonna take it. I've already had two, but there's a little bit of this left. So I'm just not gonna waste it. So I'm having a peanut butter and jelly with some bananas that have peanut butter. It is PB Fit, one point for up to three of these. I'm sending Joe with a sandwich and a banana tomorrow. And he's probably gonna have some chips too. I'm having some grapes as well for my dinner. <laughs> right now, I'm just having the grapes that were at the bottom that have already fallen off the vine because I'm too lazy to pick them off right now. So, perfect. This is carb not or carb not a something, and it's got um, it's a cinnamon raisin bread. I've never had it before. It's a first time for me. Also, guys, I don't drink a lot of pop, but like recently, my tummy wanted Sprite, so I'd had a Sprite every few days. I'm not drinking a ton of pop. Um, Things evolve. I'm not drinking a ton of soda, just so you guys know, but I have had zero sugar Sprites on hand for cooking and occasionally, very occasionally, I will want a, a Sprite. I'm not drinking a ton of pop. I don't want to drink a ton of pop. I primarily drink water. Um, water and coffee are my two things of choice. Um, there are times people get mad at me because I change my mind about things. But we're allowed to change our minds, guys. I don't drink a ton of pop, and I'm not going to. But I'm not going to make myself feel guilty for occasionally wanting a zero-sugar Sprite. Erica, how do they call, what do they call pop in Louisiana? Soda. Something in my fridge doesn't smell the best. And I just cleaned it, so I don't know what's going on. Only water. Um, only water to, to the peanut butter fit. I'm probably gonna hop off of here so that I can eat. Joe's almost home. I haven't actually seen him yet since he left. And I mean, like I said, my dinner is simple. I'll probably maybe have some popcorn later. Y'all, I change my mind once or twice a day, okay? I'm a girl, I change my mind all the time. Also, I've been getting lazy, okay? I have been getting lazy and I'll be honest with you. I've been leaving these tablespoons in here because I don't use it for anything else besides this. So I've been, I've been getting a little bit lazy. Either lazy or smart. Or both, or both. I've reorganize some snacks. Oh, I love that. 
Well, honestly, I don't, this is weird, guys. I haven't tried Olipop because I'll tell you what, I am not mint. I am not using any points on soda. Those sodas do have points. And I'm just not willing to use my points on sodas because I'm using my points on my coffee. I do use points on coffee, y'all. I love coffee and a lot of people are upset with how much of it I drink per day. Doesn't matter. Makes me happy and it's all good. Oh yeah. I did the PB Fit Sugar Free on Amazon. I haven't ordered the glazed donut um, protein yet, but I am going to. Graves are zero points. Y'all, I see the Jonas Brothers in a week and a day. And I'm so excited. I wasn't going to get myself an outfit, but I am. Changed my mind. I've gone back and forth, but my friend Kelsey, she's making me a shirt. And um, the I found she found the cutest, and it's so cute. It's like a Valentine's Day type thing. And it's got hearts on it. The jacket is pink with like sequin hearts. Y'all, it is just so stinking cute. Guys, I got some coffee from this place called Sprouts today. It has, it's called a cinnamon sugar Um, cinnamon sugar cookie. It smells so good. I'm gonna have to go back and like get a lot more different kinds. They smelt so good. It was a bat, a, a bag of it for 12, which honestly, that's not bad. I've seen the peanut butter powder at Sam's, but I haven't been this, seen, seen the sugar free one yet at Sam's. I'll let you know about the bread. I'm going to hop off of here so that I can eat this before it gets too soggy. I'm excited to try it. I love the Jones Brothers. I've seen them. I've, I've, I've seen them five times so far. I've only seen them five, but I do love them. Oh, I love the Jones Brothers. I've been walking around. All day singing the Waffle House song. Sprouts it seemed like super healthy. They had a lot of really healthy stuff. I'd never been there. Okay, well, I'm going to let you all go so I can eat dinner. And I love you guys.